Hey problem solvers, here's a geometry problem for you. It's a modification of a GCSE exam question. So you're given this triangle O and B and you have these two lines M N and A B uh, cutting across the triangle and you're asked for the ratio of A P to P B. There's a really elegant solution to this problem. So if you want to give it a go yourself, then pause the video now. Okay, hopefully you gave that a go. It doesn't matter if you got to a solution or not. It's just important that you, you give these a try now and again. Um, but also, you know, feel free to just watch the video. Don't feel any pressure at all. So the only thing you need to solve this problem is that if you have a triangle and you have a line that intersects two sides and is parallel to the third side, then the ratio it divides one side into will be the same for the other side. So for example, if I have this triangle ABC and this line here divides AB uh, in half, so let's say let's call this point X. So let's say AX equals XB, then it will also divide the other side in half. So these two lengths, let's say, let's call this BY will equal YC. Uh, so this is a fact that uh, you can prove using vectors if you like, or there's different ways to prove it. Uh, but yeah, so basically if you have this line XY and it's parallel in this example to AC, Whatever ratio it divides one side, again, it will divide the other side in the same ratio. Okay, so we're going to use that fact in this problem to solve it really quickly. Uh, so firstly, we're going to draw a line parallel to MN. So we're going to draw a line from B that is parallel to MN, and this line just goes on forever. Okay, and then we're going to extend the line ON until it intersects with this line. Okay, so, so far we are perfectly fine doing that. There's nothing wrong with saying this is parallel to MN and that we, we will have a line from O that will intersect with this new line. Okay, so now notice this triangle uh, O, uh, let's call this point up here X. Let's notice this triangle OXB, uh, this line MN divides OB in half. So using what we just talked about, it will also divide OX in half. So if we're calling OAA and AN2A, then this entire length is 3A. Then NX will also be 3A because as we said, this line MN must cut both sides of that triangle in half. And now notice a different triangle. Notice this triangle in here, AXB. And then look at the line PN. Well, if it's dividing the line AX in the ratio 2 to 3, then it must also divide the, the line AB in the ratio 2 to 3. So this is going to be 2X to 3X. So that ratio we will ask for AP to BB is 2 to 3. Uh, so, you know, there's a, a really nice... Uh, neat solution there looking at uh, the ratio of the sides that are intersected by uh, a line parallel to the other side of the triangle. Hope you liked that problem. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.